beautiful snowy lake district up Helvallen today and um, we're just walking up um, a little gully and we're going to go up Dolly Wagon Pike and Nethermost Pike um, along the top so yeah I, hope, I think there's uh, quite likely that we're going to get some really nice views at the top um, it's quite cold I think it's about minus well I think it's about four degrees in the valleys which probably means it's going to be about freezing when we get to the tops um, we've got a little bit of snow, so there's not too much, but there might be more, I guess, when we get to the top. But we've got all of our winter gear with us, uh, so maybe we'll have to get it out, but maybe not. Um, got to the top of the valley that we were at before and this is uh, Grisdale Tarn behind me and um, so I've actually been to Grisdale Tarn before when I was walking the coast to coast last summer um, but it was a very different day and it was completely misty and I couldn't see Grisdale Tarn at all so it's amazing to come back with such spectacular views so that's the way that we've come up over there and you can see all of those mountains of grassmeres in that direction and then just through there, you can't really see it um, on the video, but that's actually um, the sea through there, which is cool. Uh, so we're just heading up um, sort of this path over here. You can't really see it. Um, and then this hill here is uh, Dolly Wagon Pike. <laughs> just walking down from the top of Helvellyn now um, we, we walked sort of along the top so sort of uh, over here a bit and um, it was beautiful the sun was shining it was glorious um, and then when we got to as we we're walking up to Helvellyn uh, sort of there was a big cloud so yeah we didn't get much of a view at the top but we did get a little one um, and the clouds sort of come in a bit now so we've still got a view but it's it's not so sunny so we're just walking down 
uh, this path and that sort of view. There's this big dark cloud, so I'm hoping it's not gonna snow or rain anytime soon. And um, we've also just decided to um, put our crampons on. So we don't really need them, but they help a little bit. But I've actually never worn crampons before. So this is my first time wearing them. So we're having a little bit of a practice um, whilst it's safer. So if we do get into a situation where we do need them, it's not so scary. I'm back in the car after our hike. I'm feeling quite tired now. Um, I guess I haven't really done a like a big mountain hill walk for quite a while. So yeah, it's definitely taken it out of me. Um, yeah, so we had a little practice with our crampons on the way down there. At first we didn't need them, but then it kind of got a bit icy. So we were actually really glad that we had them on. Um, but yeah, I think the crampons are going to take a little bit of getting used to. Um, I don't know, your feet feel like so massive and on like bits that you could normally tread on fine, it's, your foot doesn't fit on that space. Um, so it's, it's just really weird getting used to it. Um, and also gaining the trust of the crampon. So I was walking down icy patches that normally I would not be able to like you'd be slipping and sliding all over the place um so it kind of it feels wrong to put your foot on it but with a crampon on you don't slip um so i'm really looking forward to uh yeah getting out in the crampons again and um, if we can get some snow conditions again later in the season so yeah thanks for watching this video um i hope you enjoyed it as much as i have enjoyed my day um, please subscribe to my channel um, and like it and then also you know leave a comment below bye